Okay. Here's Anson um, controlling our remote controlled inflatable flying clownfish that we got for Christmas from Brian and Norma. Overall, how would you say this rates as a Christmas gift? It's, it's really good. It's hilarious. It drives kind of like uh, Bill's 49 Ford does. We've named it the Hindenfish. Or the Clownenberg. I like Hindenfish. I'm sure most of you would agree. In a moment, we're going to take it over to the cat. Oh, it hit the cupboard! Oh, the humanity! <laughs> go, clownfish, go! Come, Luna! Luna. This is Luna. You can see her kind of at the end of the hall. Luna doesn't like things that get bigger from being smaller. Let's see how she does with the Hinden fish. Let's see how I do trying to drive it down the hallway. <laughs> Good girl, Luna. Hi, Luna. Here it comes. She's not impressed. Hinden fish, the silent stalker. Doesn't exactly turn on a dime. All right, you want to go scare the cat next? Okay. All right. We're on our way to go see how the cat likes the hidden fish. Found a bird. I gotta go assist. Okay. Hi, kitty. What's this? Here comes a Hinden fish. Found a bird. Turn off the air cleaner. <laughs> Kitty cares not. Dana, Dana, dun 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 dun. Oh look, he's taking a poop. <laughs> <laughs> the ribbon looks like he's going for a poop. 
No! 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 Oh! oh. <laughs> Clownfish, the silent killers. It's just like one of those underwater Jacques Cousteau films, isn't it? <laughs> Dive with me to the deep where we find the remote controlled floating clown fish. At home in its natural environment, the floating clownfish prefers modular homes, prefabricated ones. <laughs>